We will all walk through times in our lives when it feels like it is a low and dark valley and sometimes even seems like you're walking through it alone. Whether it's the betrayal of a close friend, a Judas in your midst, someone you trusted that hurts you oh so deep, or perhaps a failed marriage, or maybe a child walking in the world in disobedience, or a health scare you have no control over, like this hand of mine, or a financial crisis you just can't seem to get a grip on, the desire to be married unfulfilled, or the yearning deep down inside to hold your own child, but you cannot conceive, and the list goes on. No matter what we go through in life, I wanted to remind you today that in the midst of life's trials, and they will come, to focus your gaze on Jesus as your foundation and your rock and not be enveloped by the circumstances that are out of your control around you. I'm reminded of Peter as he is walking on water. Fathom that he's walking on water supernaturally. As his gaze is fixed on Jesus, he is walking. But as soon as he looks at the circumstances he is in, they overtake him and he begins to drown. So dear friend, in the midst of life's trials, don't tell God how big your circumstance is. Don't tell him how out of control it is. Walk in faith by quoting scripture and standing on the word of God and tell your circumstance how big your God is. And so I want to conclude with Luke 137. As you walk in faith and watch God fight your battles, as you as a believer rest in the shelter of the Most High and in the shadow of the Almighty, the safest place to be in the midst of life's circumstances.